Dig in southern Genesee County leads to a surprising find. Now police are looking into the possibility of unearthing new evidence in a decades old cold case. Good evening everyone. I'm Bill Harris. Thanks for being with us tonight. Police say a vehicle pulled from a housing development site could be connected to the murders of four children in Oakland County back in the mid 1970s. Investigators right now at the scene of the Grand Reserve subdivision processing evidence that's near Baldwin Road just east of Saginaw Street in Grand Blanc Township. And that is where we find NBC 25's Walter Smith Randolph with the latest on this breaking news. Walter. Bill, construction crews were here digging a new basement when they found several car parts. One of those car parts belonged to an ANC gremlin. That car is connected to the Oakland County child killer case in which four children were kidnapped and killed back in the 1970s. And that's why police are here literally trying to get to the bottom of this. Oh, it's a nice, quiet neighborhood, all seniors, over 55. Very quiet, tranquil. Neighbors at the Grand Reserve subdivision in Grand Blanc Township in for a big shock Tuesday as police uncover parts of an AMC gremlin. They did locate a part that they believe to be from a blue and color gremlin. Uh, that blue and gremlin did have a white stripe on it. That car's description matching the suspect information of the Oakland County child killer. Kids couldn't uh, go to school without signs in the windows. You need protection going in this house here, you know, because of that crime in Oakland. The Oakland County child killer was never found, but police always on the lookout for that blue car with the white stripe. We're just kind of looking at our due diligence to make sure that uh, this is either part of that investigation part of another investigation or actually just a dump. But amazing, it's, uh, it's just close, you know. <laughs> Michigan State Police tell us they sound several car parts to several different cars and that they have all been removed and taken to the Michigan State Police Crime Lab for processing. We will bring you the latest information as it becomes available on our website, mynbcnews.com. For now, we're live in Grambling Township. Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News.